today the 18th of May 2019 and we've got a Pleasure Beach experience meet up at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. So we're not doing any ERTs or behind the scenes tours today, we're just doing a good old fashioned coaster enthusiast meet up here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach and the first ride of the day is going to be a takeover on the Big Dipper. I would imagine that we will take over most rides today with the group size being pretty large. So Karen and Steph spotted the camera, but Mike didn't, which surprises me. And the rest of the PBE group are currently waiting for the next train. Big Dipper has started the day on one train today which makes me think we're in for a very quiet day here at the Pleasure Beach. Some big dipper riders. Welcome back, <laughs> riders. How was your ride? Hey, it was all right. Good. Yes. Good stuff. Stuz, how was your ride on the big dipper? It was very, very good, actually. <laughs> very, very good. Uh, David and Graham almost laughed us. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. High lap bar. <laughs> High lap bar treatment. So, uh, shall we go and do Icon next? Yes. Yeah. Maybe have a lunch on the way before it gets a big queue, like. Yeah. yeah. Hope we already like two hours long. Yeah. Yeah. So the, the, the group has got bigger because we've been joined by Airtime John. John! Doug somewhere. Here he is. Doug in there. Mullet's joined us over there too. Oh, yeah, Mr. Camera Hungry has arrived. Shall we do Icon? Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Icon? Icon, yeah. Oh, oh, actually, hold on, we've still got people on Big Dipper. So, who's been on Big Dipper, Mike? Me. How, how was it? Best Woody on Park. Best Woody on Park, yeah. still? Oh, yeah. How's it running today, though, in particular? Very, very good. Very, very good. Needs a bit of warming up, but smooth. Good stuff. Um, good although, stuff. I was on a non-wheel. You're on a non-wheel. So it always helps. So, yeah, we've got a nice big group here at the Pleasure Beach today. Just waiting on a couple more people to come off the Big Dipper. And then we'll probably go and do Avalanche, Icon, and probably work our way around to the, the Arrows as well. Yeah. And this is a behind the scenes of Springy Tails vlog. <laughs> so the group is now heading over to Nickelodeon Street. We thought we'd better off doing that early on, just in case Pleasure Beach does get busy with having the one train. So we're going to do Nickelodeon Street and then probably move around to doing the Arrow Coasters. How was your ride? That was really fun actually. That was a nice little floaty air time all around. Good start good to fun. the day. Yeah. That's a good second coaster of the day. Second coaster of the day. Question yeah. is, is it better than the dipper? Yeah, the dipper's better than that. Dipper's better. Yeah, just, it's, it is a really good coaster, especially yeah. for its age. And the boat mark, not the big dipper's young. In fact, it's weak. That's older than Dipper, isn't it? Uh, no, Dipper's older. Well, bits of this is older than yeah, Dipper. Yeah, Dipper was redone in 1936. Yeah. So technically Roller's got an older layout, but Dipper yeah. was built first, if that makes sense. Neither of them's spring no, they're not, Yeah, they're not young. <laughs> and uh, neither's Mike. How was that for you? Very good, very good, very good. Unit. Very good, very good. good. You sure second it's Second best Woody on part. Second best Woody on part. I reckon there's someone that might disagree, so I'm going to bring them in. Best. That's how a Woody's meant to ride. Scaled up, scaled down, it doesn't matter. That's how it's meant to feel. You enjoy it then? Yes. And they've got to paint the Nash bright orange to get it to run like that. They need to get on with it. <laughs> we need to more than paint it orange. Well, yeah, but they need to do something. That is running better today. That is running better today. I think for good measure you should show us how much you like this ride. The old logo before it was Nickelodeon Street. That was done the day the site.
sign was taken down. Well, did you take the sign to the tattooist to say, scale that down for us, will you? If only I had that sign. We need to find it. Apparently it was broken. Probably. So hard. How was it, Ollie? It was, be it was better than Big Dipper's running this morning. Uh, do you reckon? I reckon. Big Dipper was a little, little tad buff. That was really yeah. A bit, a little bit, a bit slow. A bit yeah. rough. A bit rough. Yeah. Yeah. Will you learn to stay in shot one day? Yeah. Let's ask Mark. How was it? It's all right, you know that. It's good. I enjoyed it. Second best on park, but... Second best on park. Yeah, I did. good. I really enjoyed it. So there's a ride behind you that I think we should get Mike on. What do you think? The log flume? Yeah. PBE Big Ball. PBE Fat Ball. PBE Fat Ball. Well, I'm glad you said it and not me. Oh, oh, it's fat ball. It's just for the occasion. He's got his coat on. Yeah, yeah, he's going to say... You, you I am a member in said club. It's only water, as Ian would say. Ian's not here, so someone's got to take over there. It cannot be any better than water. It cannot be any wetter than water. That is a very good point. I think we'll have to put a card in the top of the screen for anyone that's not seen that yet. Like the 2K people who have seen it now. No, that was just like us three watching it over and over again. It was like refreshing it several times. So we've taken one ride on the Revolution, one ride on the big one, and we're going to do the big one again because it's on two trains and has very little kin. Mark, Stuss, how are you finding your day at Pleasure Beach so far? Enjoyable, isn't it? It's a laugh. We're having a great laugh. Yeah, yeah it's good to like, you get such a big group together. It's been really good interacting with everybody. Yeah, yeah. It's and the sun is shining. Yeah. The weather is sweet. We thought, we thought it was going to rain, but the sun is out. Good stuff. So, not much of a queue on the big one. Big. How many times do you think we'll do it today? Oh, I reckon it might be ten. Ten? Ten. Oh, ten group rides on the big one. Yeah, definitely. Michael, I can off this and then carry on on this. Yeah, good shout. So yeah, like I say, it's on two trains, not much of a queue, and the park's open for another five or six hours, so we're going to get lots of rides on it today. So yeah, it's a really quiet day here at Blackpool Pleasure Week. So far we've been on the big one, Blue Flyer, Big Dipper, Nickelodeon Street and the Revolution. So I'll get some thoughts from everyone, what they thought about the big one. We'll start with Mullet, from being a big one fanboy. Hello. How was that? Very good. Very good. As always. Yeah. Loving it as ever. Yes. Good, good Train, stuff. Training at the moment for its older brother. Yeah. You certainly are. And the marathon day that's coming yeah. up, anniversary yeah. day. Yeah. 25 rides. Yeah. Going to do it? Let's go. You're going to manage it? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Good stuff. Yeah. You think you'll manage it, Mark? 25 yeah. rides on its anniversary? Definitely. Back row. Back row each time? Every time. Every, every time. Every time back row. Where have you gone? Can't wait for that day. Good stuff. It's good to see it for us with no queue, but not so good for the park. That's surprising, really, isn't it? Like, yeah. Basically, the first time I went in, you basically the year again, so it's like a bit, a bit more in on a Saturday, but it's not right for us. Yeah, it's good for us. That's it's also, Icon's looking very quiet, which is a bit. Yeah. I think we'll be heading there shortly. I'm, I'm guessing we're going to be missing Steeple with that queue and yeah. going straight over to Icon. Yeah, so, I'm going to ask Owen. Owen was sat behind me on the second go, and I don't think you enjoyed that very much. That was really, really rough. That first drop head, that was a fun one. Showing his age now. Yeah, I think it is, to be fair. It's a big one, isn't it? I think a bit like the Grand National, it depends where you sit. Yeah, if you're not over the wheel, absolutely fine. I think, but if you're over the wheel, you're on the right of Yeah. Stuz, what do you think? Yeah. <laughs> Same as Owen, really. It's, it's getting a bit rough in this whole day. Yeah. Man, you out, we all. <laughs> <laughs> and I know for a fact that Becca didn't really enjoy it. No, that was awful. It needs some, a lot of love and attention. It's, that's the worst ride in 20 odd years. I can't remember ever being that bad and not wanting to be riding. It's a shame. Really bad, disappointing. Doug, what did you think of it? I still, I still enjoyed it. I didn't find it any worse than it than usually is anyway. That's fair enough. Um, well, it'll be interesting to see what happens with the old girl. Yeah, well, we'll leave that for another day, the debate. Let's get some more opinions. So, where's, where's Jolly Mike? Where's Mike gone? How did everyone find it, though? All right? Yeah. All right? Good stuff.
Good stuff. We've had some contrasting opinions. Did you enjoy the big one or was it a bit rough for you? Fun, yeah. yeah rough but fun. Rough but fun. Yeah. I think that's a great way of describing it, definitely. We appear to have lost Mike, which is quite difficult to do. So I think the next ride that we're going to head over to do is Icon. Next up for the group is a ride on Icon and it's almost a year to the day that we rode Icon for the first time. It was on the 19th of May 2018 and today's the 18th of May 2019 so it's almost a year since our first ever ride on Icon and we were on the boarding pass rides last year on the first four or five public trains on the Club PBE event. The group's not quite as big today but it is still a very big group for a meet-up and I think it's fair to say everyone's having a great time at the Pleasure Beach so far. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Still's a year since our first go on this, can you believe that? Yeah, where's it gone? It's just gone so fast. Too fast. Still loving Icon as much as that first go though. Great. Yeah. Good stuff. Bet you're looking forward to Helix now. Very much so. Good stuff. So Icon is on two trains today and we have pretty much created a queue for it because before we joined the queue there wasn't really many people in the queue at all. So yeah, we'll see you after a few rides on Icon. Yeah. Just taking our first group ride on Icon of the day. One in opinion I'm interested in getting is Mullets. Hello. Come on then, how was it? Your first time since you went on Helix. Still very good. Good stuff. But Helix is better. Oh, definitely, no doubt about it. But it is better. But you still like it. Yeah, I still love it. That's the main thing. That, that is the main thing. I still like it after Helix. I think it, that's the most important thing. I think most people at Pleasure Beach that have done both who work here would probably say. Helix is Icon's daddy. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. But yeah, so Beckett. What do you think? Slow. Second fastest ride at Pleasure Beach, though. Doesn't show. It feels <laughs> sluggish. It'll Slug warm up. It felt like it struggled, and it shouldn't feel like that. It'll warm up over the day, it always it does. It should just run like it's meant to in the morning. That's max for you, though. It's had how many hours? I don't know. What, what time is it? That's a Mac tray. It's, right, it's, it's a one Mac tray. It's one o'clock. It's had plenty of time to warm up. It should be running fine. Do you hear the squeaking of the wheels? No. Every time it goes over the launch and over the top, it squeaks. That's a Mac thing. It's a Mac thing. It's well, got Mac the... needs to sort it out then, eh? <laughs> Mark, how was it? It's all right. Mac, we're all right. Me and, me and John preserved really well. Enjoyed that. Good stuff. Good. That's the main thing. Stuz, John, how was Icon? It was very good. Fun. It was great fun as usual. Good stuff. A year since we uh, run it for the first time, I can't believe it. Where, where's the time gone? It's just gone in a flash, hasn't That's it? That's insane, the thing. It's insane, yeah. Good stuff, I'm glad you're still enjoying it. Let's get some more opinions. How was Icon, guys? Good? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Yeah, it's all right. Favourite ride at Pleasure Beach? Yeah, Icon. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff, let's get some more opinions. Big one's good, yeah. Big one's good though. Let, let's vlog bomb John before he starts. Hello. Hello, how right. was Icon? It was great, yeah, it was a bit rattly. It's that rattly train. But I love the ride, you know how much I love it. It's a brilliant ride. And I'm looking forward to comparing it to Helix in July. Not long to go. Not long to go at all. And I'm, I'm hoping, I'm hoping it's going to be even better than this. Thank I'd you say know. you'll probably find it is. Yeah? Yeah, but you'll still like Icon after it. That's, that's the main thing. beautiful ride, beautiful ride. Lots of air time. In fact, that was the loosest I have ever had to be straight. I've lost Good. a little bit of weight, so I'm feeling the benefit now. Good stuff. But um, yeah, I was flying out my seat there, so yeah. Brilliant dead stuff. Well. Why is it so dead? I have no idea, mate. It's not good, is it, on a Get Saturday? Come to Pleasure Beach, everyone. Yeah, Pleasure Beach. Happy experience. Everybody's going to be 
So we're back in the flying machine shop, and since our last merchandise video, the Pleasure Beach, I found some flags to sell. Belgium, Germany. Depends which way up you hold it. Yeah, it is. So the pricing for the flags. And my personal opinion is that these flags are excellent and I would definitely buy one. Unfortunately, my personal opinion is also that 75 quid upwards is too much for a flag. And some of them are blank. Some of them are completely blank. Well, they'd, they'd be alright in the office window, but just not for 75 quid. We've got forbidden. I think that it must be forbidden. I'm not going to open it up because I'm not buying it, but there's loads of Pleasure Beach flags. And Mr. Funshine as well, which, if you're watching, Mark Forrest, I know you'll definitely like these. What have you got there, Becca? Oh, yeah, it's all gold. Maybe not. Oh, no. Wales. Um, so, we have some other things in the shop since we were last in here filming. I'm pretty sure that every time we do come to the Pleasure Beach, there's new merch on sale. So there's been some extra ride parts put on sale since the last time we did a video in here. And also some former ride signage. And here we have the exit sign from the Wild Mouse. Now that is, I believe, £250. I believe you do get Pleasure Beach Season Pass discount, though. And also some little bits of Wild Mouse wood. And a red nose off one of the old Wild Mouse cars. And there is some more Big One track available, which is £150. Let us know in the comments what you think about the new merch here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. So we've had lunch in the Velvet Coaster, we've checked out the merch and now most of the group are about to ride the Grand National and Airtime John is filming me, filming him. As with every Pleasure Beach experience event or meetup at Blackpool Pleasure Beach, it's time to ride the Rugrats Lost River. So of course there's plenty of us watching, but the good news is Mike is on the ride and kind of at the front of his boat. Uh, the PBE guys aren't quite on yet, They're still in the queue or just about getting on. Airtime John's bottled it, unfortunately. Bottled it big time. Bottled I'm not going to lie, I bottled it. <laughs> yeah, you didn't, you didn't want all that sponsored Nivea running down the back of your top, did you, and no, stuff like no, that? No, no, it's, uh, I'm not sponsored by Nivea anymore, by the way. Oh, right. It's Under Armour UK Under now. Under Armour UK. Yeah. Yeah, more money. More money, oh, good stuff. I'm glad the sponsorship's good. Yeah, great hat, keep you cool and protected. Like Nivea, if you yeah. want to take me on again. <laughs> Molly, Hello. Mark, not doing it, but looking oh, forward to... Already, you've had a video of me getting wet fairly recently. Yeah. Yes, we have, which yeah, was great. Did you love it, yeah. Play that again, and again, and I, again. I'm going to send it into You've Been Framed. Try and claim the 250 quid yeah, for it. Send it to me. No, you're all right. Yeah. I filmed it. I, I, I was the one who will get you the 250 quid. <laughs> exactly. Oh, we have a boat coming. Sorry, false alarm. It is a PBE boat, though. Oh, the first PBE boat. I think that was quite high on the mildly moist scale. Here comes Mike's boat, the main event, and the pap PB paparazzi are out. <laughs> yes. Definitely high on the mildly voice scale. He's got us up though. There we go.
taking our ride on the log flume, or I should say ride. And now it's time for the big one again. It's glowing Owen. Hey. <laughs> Hello. One of the don't notice the camera. <laughs> Looking a bit wet there, Mark. Here's Johnny. <laughs> Johnny, John. Here's Johnny. <laughs> and John. How was the big one? Oh, good as ever. Good as ever. Yeah, 25 years has made no difference. Still a brilliant roller coaster, one of my favourites of all time. And as I said before, nothing's got that view. Next time you're on it, as you're dropping over, just look out. And no other coaster in this country or within Europe can have that view, can it? Especially if you go on it in the autumn when the lights are on. You can't beat it for me. Excellent. A big one fanboy right there. Definitely. Through Rightly through. so. And deliberately so, slightly so. How was it for you, Doug, this time? Yeah, still love it. Still love it. Oh, that's a good answer. Mullet? Hello. Good? Bad? Yeah, very good. Not put off by the puke and the uh, seats in front of us? That was boring. Not what? The staff made the puke that, but... No. To be fair, the staff cleaned it up pretty quickly. Yeah. And then there's some on the exit ramp, just for good measure. <laughs> And here's an airtime John behind just, the scenes. We've just, had to, we've just had to stand over the sink there, which wasn't nice, but you know, anyway, sorry. Pepsi Max puke one. <laughs> How was the big one, Ollie? Aye, it was alright. Still my favourite UK coaster, so. It is? Yeah. I remember when you used to not like it. I know, right? April 20th I've changed everything and now it's still top coaster for me, so. Good stuff. Not running quite as well today. I mean, I cut four, so that's. I got fourth, what, yeah. what second and third then? Second is Nemesis, third is Smiler. Oh, right, we'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. We'll leave it in the game. So yeah, everyone's having a great day here at the Pleasure Beach. We've got about two hours left. I'd imagine we'll take another ride on the big one and icon at some point. Still to do steeplechase too. His does. Uh, yeah, but somebody didn't like that. Someone's puked on the uh, exit ramp. <laughs> Pepsi Max puke one. Puke one. New yeah. name. The puke one. Puke. I don't know who's done it. Was it more enjoyable than earlier? Yeah, we're about the same, really. About the same. Yeah. So we're approaching the final hour here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach and we've decided to come and have a peaceful ride on the Pleasure Beach Express. Although it's not going to be much more peaceful because Mike's going to start talking. Choo choo. Choo choo. How's your day going? Really good. Really good? Yep. Any particular highlights so far? Social. Social. It's been great to see so many people yeah. come out for the meetup. Lots of new faces today. Yep. How are the rides running? Oh, really good. Oh, hold on a minute. That. Quite pleased with that. So yeah, has that been your favourite ride of the day? I think so, yeah. yeah. Oh, a big one for pretty good earlier on. Yeah, you don't think it's a bit sluggish today though? Um, I think I might have got the point of train. Yeah, there's definitely, so. the, the staff did mention there's one fast yeah. train and one sort of slower train on today. The second so. time I've been on was a lot quicker. Yeah. The first time, so I must have been on the faster train. I think there is a slight westerly wind today, so I think that might have had something to do with Showing it as well. Showing east before. Hey. Showing east this morning on BBC. Yeah, it's definitely westerly. <laughs> westerly wind. It's not a cold wind, is it? If it was a cold wind, it'd be easterly. Westerly, it's usually quite a warm wind, which is weird to me. Yeah, I mean, I went on a big one before and I thought it was flying round, so clearly one train's going a lot better than the other, I would say. Yeah. Are you enjoying the day, Stu? Oh, Stu, yeah. I was going to call you Stu's then. No, that's all right. Uh, no, I only got here at lunchtime. I had a couple of other things on. But, yeah, it's, it's been a great afternoon so far. I'm surprised the park's not busier, to be honest, on a day like this. It's yeah. Not... It's a shame, really. Yeah, uh, it is. You know, got a new icon. It's only a year old. It's just 
seem to be drawing the crowds. I don't know why, but it's good enough, right? I do think the weather's turned out better than it was forecast. Yeah, that's true enough, yeah. It was forecast miserable, weren't it, earlier in the week? Yeah, yeah. it was, yeah. They don't always get it right, though, do they? Like, no, they've been getting it, it wrong a lot lately, actually. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, even if it is raining, does it want to do with it? Yeah, there's plenty of good dark rides to do if it does chuck it down. Yeah, definitely. Any rides in particular you want to do before the day ends, Mike? I think we're going to go and have a look at uh, the Glorious. What's that? Infusion. Yes. Oh, right, OK, then. <laughs> oh, very good. <laughs> oh, oh, very good. very brave or very stupid now, which is that? It's not been running too bad this year, to be honest. Oh, Have you done it yet this season? Once. <laughs> Once. I think it was with you, actually, Scott. Yeah, yeah. Mike Welbidge. I've been that many times already. I've <laughs> got memory loss. Yeah, I was understandable. I think it's about my eighth, is it, to be fair? Yeah. Season pass, paid for. C correct. Yeah. It's paid for after the well, weekends, yeah, to be honest. Yeah, well, it is, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm hoping it's running well. It's been a while since you've been on it. Yeah. Yeah. But Dipper is one of those that some days it runs amazingly, and other days it just can't be bothered. So I'm hoping it's a good day. Yeah, but well, it was running really well last week, so let's hope so. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> Hopefully it's running like Roller. Yeah. I'll be happy then. Good stuff. So we've just had a ride on Big Dipper. Peck is off to Nick Land with Charlie, but yep. quickly, how was it? That was good, running good. quite well, yeah. Still not better than Roller? No. 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 Close though? Close, but Close. it'll never take over. Never take over. No. Fair enough. Well, we'll see you soon then. Yeah. And uh, enjoy Dora the Explorer. <laughs> Big Jeff. <laughs> Big Jeff, so Stuss, how was yeah. Big Dipper? That was great fun. Great fun? Yeah. I mean, think about Big Dipper, it, people say it's rough. But yeah, it's a woody, but also you've got the uh, padded seats, so even, even though you've been uh, thrown about, it, it's comfortable as well. Yeah, and it you've is. got to consider its age. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's not doing bad for a 96-year-old, is it? No, exactly. No. no. I, mean, I hope I'm in that good a condition when I'm 96. Well, you're not far off now, anyway. Oh, no, so. no, a few years to go, yeah. <laughs> How was it, Stu and Stu? Uh, yeah, consistently the same, isn't it? Yeah, I suppose you could argue it's slightly rough, but I enjoy it. I mean, for the ride of its age, it runs remarkably well and consistently. I mean, that's a testament to the maintenance people here, isn't it, really? That they keep on top of it so well. They yeah. Keep running so well. They maintain it excellently, don't they? Yeah, I mean, I'd like to find another 90-odd year old roller coaster that's as consistent as that is throughout the season. Yeah, very good. I enjoy it every time. The final ride of the day is going to be the big one, and it's down to one fully open train and one sandbag train, but there's still just no queue. So it's a good way to end. We do usually end the day on Icon, but it's a nice little change, get all the group back on the big one again. And it, well, just looking at that train there going into the station, it is just really quiet. But fair play to the Pleasure Beach staff. They've kept the big one on two trains all day. They've kept Icon on two trains all day, despite it being a really, really quiet day for a Saturday in, in May. Having a bit of a poet, don't you know it moment there. So quiet. So that's the end of our meet at the beach, Pleasure Beach experience meet up here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Mark, how's your day been? It's been superb, you know. Not needed any ERTs or anything no. like that. It's just been nice to get a load of us together yeah. and have some real good times on, on Pleasure Beach. Everyone's turned up and enjoyed themselves, as I yeah. can see anyway, so big hug. Over 40 people here today. It's been a great day. We've got on all the coasters except for Steeple Chase. That was out of choice. I asked if anyone wanted to go to Steeple and I just got the yeah, but icons that way, so we went to Icon instead. Yeah, it's been a great day. Thanks to everyone that's come and joined us today. If you've not been to a Pleasure Beach experience, meet up or event, you're more than welcome. 
The only restriction that we have in place, and this is something that we've done for years, if you're under 16, you must attend with an adult who's a family member. And I think all the coastal clubs do that anyway. So that's the only restriction on meetups and events. Obviously, if we have ERTs, they pay in advance. But days like today, it's just a meetup. Everyone's welcome. So keep an eye out on our socials. There will be more meetups here at Pledge Beach. So thanks for watching. Thanks to everyone who came. And we'll see you soon in the next Pledge Beach Experience video.